welcome back everyone to Carolina Spiders. You did see part one, so now we're here for part two. Um, part one, we just put her in here. These are the non dukermatises And as I would say in the first video, I will say in this video, I like the green better. Um, and we did get these from the uh, Dollar Tree. I'm always looking for something new, try something different. I did mix a different substrate on here as I did that one, and I'm going to try to figure out which one works the best, and you know, everyone knows not every tarantula is the same, so one may burrow and the other one may not. Um, this is a non dukermatis and what I have experienced so far is as them being um, spiderlings and juveniles, they do tend to burrow a whole lot more than the adults. But... With that being said, we're going to place uh, this one in here. And if you haven't seen the first one, you need to go back and watch it. I try to throw something a little different here and there. Um, and like I say, if you've seen any of my other videos, you'll know that I do not... Why are you curled up? Oh, you're just nervous. I should get too much in here. Go ahead and move some of the stuff up there. Maybe I can... How am I gonna do this? Okay, so it is right here. Now, definitely loves to um, hide. Hey, listen. See if I can bugger enough to uh, either run out on my hand, on my arm, throw my leg across the table. Come on now, come on, girl or boy. A good shot. And they're still beautiful, even when they're small. But once they get their dark colors, they're absolutely gorgeous. Can you give me a moment? We'll just. As you're looking at that beauty thing, I'm going to try to take this sticker off here and I got it. And don't mind the mumbling, I mumble a lot. And I'm going to touch this side so she'll probably run down. And she did. And I got the sticker. Looking good. Um, like I did, I wet this uh, little moss here, keep it damp a little bit. We'll see what she does. I know when they were in here, they really just moved the moss around. I didn't really put anything else in there. I allow them to, to do their burrowing or whatever there is. It is a little bit, it is a little big. Uh, the tarantula is not as big as I was expecting her to be. But they've both been in, in these right here for a couple months. I usually leave them in there. Um, not much of a climber. But other than that, this is the non dukermatis And it's one of my favorites. As she creeps around and tries to uh, explore. And she'll find her little corner and lay in it. Just to feel safe. They do kick hair. I haven't had these little guys kick hair, but the bigger one I have, she loves to kick hair. Loves to kick here. But hopefully I do find a male and you know I get a pair. At least once. I want to try it once in my life. Never tried it before. I feel like it would be a different experience. And yeah. And um with that being said, put this on here, get the lid on, put that in there, and um, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give me a like. If you haven't seen part one, please go back and watch that. It's awesome. And um, I hope to see you in the next one.